previous thank you for joining us here we want to find the value of x from this math olympiad question and here let us factor out s square so we have s square out into bracket what will be here with x now minus one left here then equals to 100 so again we can see that here now we can write 100 we can split it and say this is s square into bracket x minus 1 then equals to we can write our 100 as 25 times 4 then each of these multiply give us 25 times 4 let's see the first one here which is s square is 25 and the second number which is x minus 1 is equals to 4 so let's equate this to 25 and x minus 1 to 4 so from there when we solve further now on this side when we take the square root on both sides x here will now be square plus or minus square root of 25 because anytime we take square root we have two possible solutions plus or minus so here we can see x equals to plus or minus 5 which are two possible answers there that is x is either is equals to 5 or we have x equals to minus 5 then from this side as well, x minus 1 equals to 4, we can say that s equals to 4 plus 1. When we take minus 1 to that side, that s equals to 4 plus 1, that's 5. So we have x equals to 5 on this side, s equals to 5 on this side. We can take 1 actually from there and with this one. So one of these with this so is it that our x is 5 now or our x is minus 5 so we can check to check to check from the problem we are given that is s cube minus s square equals 200 will this be true for the solution that we have let's put when x is 5 that's 5 cube now minus 5 square will it give us 100 and we test that one now 5 cube that give us 125 then minus 5 square that's 25 of course that's equals to 100 so this one is correct 5 is correct also when we put s equals to minus 5 there and that will be so that will give us minus 5 cube minus minus 5 square will this give us 100 let's check it out we have minus 5 cube that will give us minus 125 then minus minus 5 square that will give us 25 of course this will give us minus 150 and which is now equals to 100 so here now minus 5 here is not a solution therefore we can see that our x equals to 5 is the correct solution to that we say thank you for joining us and uh, if you are yet to subscribe don't forget to click on the subscription button see you in the next class bye for now